Hello, my learners. Welcome back again. Today, we are going to look at an interesting subject. Eh? The subject is what? Our world, our people. We have been calling it OWEB, OWEB, OWEB. Eh? The full name is what? Our world, our people. And our topic is plants and what? Animals. Plants and animals. Now, looking at your environment, eh, we have a lot of what? Plants. And surely you can name some of the plants, isn't it? Good. So let's look at some plants in our environment. These are the few that I have what? Written down. So some plants from your what? Environment. We have the maize, what? The maize plants. Eh, the maize plants, or you can only just write maize. We also have what? The cocoa. We also have mango, we have the plantain, we have the coconut, and we have the word purple. All these are plants in, a, in the world environment. You can also name some shea butter. We also have um, our flowers. We also have the cassava plant, the yam plant. All these are plants in, a, in the world in the environment. Sometimes. Some of them beautifies what our environment. These are nice flowers with the nice what scents. All right. So now, these plants some are useful. Not some. Most plants are very what useful. We use them in so many what ways. So let's look at some uses of what plants. Some uses of plants. Now, food. Food. Food, our cassava, the plantain, the coconut, the purple, the maize that we have been eating, we have been enjoying. Where do we get them from? Surely we get them from where? Plants. So we get what? Food from what? Plants. Medicine. Some of our medicine, we get it from what? Plants. So medicine is got from plants. Uh, our medicine, the herbal ones. We, we have the the traditional medicine, and we also have some of the herbal ones. We get them from what plants. The next one we have our furniture, and I hope you know your furniture, your tables and chairs, your nice uh, sofa that you enjoy sleeping in and uh, receiving fresh air, your nice chairs in your room. Your nice tables in your room. We all we we got all from where plants. You see, so furniture we get furniture from where plants. Our clothes, the clothes we wear, mm -hmm. the clothes we wear. These nice clothes and yours, your nice trousers, your nice dresses that you be wearing. We get all that from where plants. Lorry tie, lorry tie. And I hope you, you, you've seen a lorry tie before. That is tie. That is car. The tie. That's the lorry's what? Tie. And we get those things from where? Plants. We also have what? Our baskets. Our baskets. And let me show you some pictures. If you don't know the lorry tie. Now let's see. I was talking about clothes. These are some of the examples of the clothes. What you wear. And what we put on, we get them from where plants. We also get our lorry ties also from where plants. And these are baskets and our canes. They are all gotten from where plants. So these are the uses of what plants. Or these are what we get from what plants. We get food, medicine, furniture, clothes, lorry tie. And what again? Basket. Now, I said our topic is what plants and animals. So we have talked about plants. We look at some plants in our environment. We've been able to name six, and surely you can name more. And we also look at the uses of what plants. Let's move on and talk about what animals. Now, we have a lot of animals. We have a lot of animals. You can see animals wherever, in your homes, on the streets, in the school, 
when you come to school, sometimes you see some animals. Sometimes too, you see animals grazing. Good. So let's look at some animals that we have. Now, animals in our community. We have domestic animals. Let me say domestic animals. Domestic animals are animals that live in our what? homes. Uh, domestic animals are animals that live in our homes. An example we have what? Cats, dog, rabbit, cock, parrot. You can name some. You can name some animals that live in our what? homes. Monkey is also there. Monkey is there. All right, so let's move on to the next animal that we know in our community. We have what? Reptiles. Reptiles. These reptiles, they are animals which have scales and crawl. Animals which have scales and crawl. Scales and crawl. We have, when we say crawl, uh, they, with their chest and stomach on the floor, uh, as to how baby would crawl. So we have snake, frog, and what? Lizard. And these are the examples of animals that what crawl. They have scales and what crawl. These are the animals. The next one we have was insects. Insects. You've been seeing the cockroach every day in your houses, in your room, or some places you've seen cockroach, but you don't know whether it's an insect or a domestic animal. Because it is in your house, you may think it's a domestic animal. Please. Cockroach is an insect. Cockroach is an insect. So insects are animals which have six legs, wings, and can fly. That is why if you see the cockroach, you want to kill it, it flies what? Away, you cannot kill. So we have insects, which are animals which have what six legs, wings, and can fly. An example we have what butterfly. We also have mosquito. We have what the grasshopper and our what cockroach. Here they are. Butterfly, mosquito, grasshopper, and what are cockroach. All right, so let's move on. We have mammals, mammals, and uh, which animals do we refer to as mammals? Animals which have four legs, mouth, and breast. Animals which have four legs, mouth, and what? Breast. Example now, do you have a dog in your house? Yes. Sometimes the dog, is our what our pet so we could play with it by touching what some parts what of the body you could see that the dog has what four legs it also has what a mouth and it has what small small what breasts so that when they give birth or when they reproduce the smaller ones can what breastfeed as human beings what does all right so we have dog rabbits lion cats, goats, etc. etc. means we have a lot. We have rabbits. We also have monkey. We have horse. We have sheep. Sheep, monkey, horse. All these are what? Mammals. All these are mammals. Please do not forget their definition. So I said reptiles are animals which have what? Skills and crawl. Skills and crawl. Check my notes for me skills and crawl we also have insects we have insects which are what animals which have six legs wings and can what fly we also have mammals giving us the four legs mouth and breast now let's continue let's continue we have birds the birds which have two legs okay the birds, they have what? Two legs, feathers, and lay eggs. And the birds, they have two legs, feathers, and what? Lay eggs. An example, we have what? Parrot, cock, turkey, guinea fowl. Let me show you them. All right, now these are birds. These are birds. The, these are birds. They have what two legs, feathers, and what lay eggs. 
are the parrot and this is the turkey. They have two legs and they lay what? Eggs. They have feathers too. This a cock and this was a guinea fowl. Guinea fowl. If you see this animal somewhere, it's now called what? Guinea fowl. All right. Now let's move on. We have what? Fish. 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 We've been chewing fishes every day. Sometimes we treat them that you know, even knowing, not knowing what their names. So what are fish? Fishes are animals which live in water, have scales, fins, but do not have legs. Fishes do not have legs. Why? Because they swim. They swim in the what? Water. So examples we have what? Tilapia. Tilapia, redfish and salmon and i hope you have enjoying this type of fishes in your house tilapia when you buy it grind the pepper prepare the bangkum ah you really enjoy with your red fish when mommy fries it oh with your salmon when it is uh, roasted or, or toasted massa you really really enjoy good that is it so these are the animals we have in our world community we have domestic animals reptiles insects mammals birds fish all right let's move on by knowing the uses of these animals uses of what animal now the first one we have what food food this the meat we have been eating every day the meat they eat chicken meat, goat meat, cow meat. Oh, name them. Can name some. Good. All this meat, we get them from where? Animals. We get this meat from animals. We also use them for sports. Animals can be used for sports. Sports. Horse racing. Where? Mm. Now, sometimes when uh, the occasion day, Occasion days at the beaches, you could see horses, people will be sitting on making what? Racing. Making racing. Let's look at a picture here. You could see them. You could see them on their what? Horses. What? Competing. They are competing to see which is the what? Winner. Okay. The third one we have transportation. Transportation. Some some of our animals are used for transporting what goods from one place to the other. In some villages or in some towns, the donkeys are used for carrying what goods for our people from one place to another. And this is an example. The donkey is carrying what goods. The donkey is carrying goods, not on the head, but on its back. On its back. All right, now we also have animal skin for leather product. Animal skin for leather product. You'll be wearing nice shoes. You'll be using nice belt. You'll be using nice bags. Mama will buy a nice bag for you, be it a school bag or a church one. We get them from animals. Animal skin, they are used for leather product. Like the leather product, like okay, let me continue. Like um, our shoes and eh? like the shoes, the shoes, the belts, and what our what bags, and eh? we get them from where animals. We get them from animals, and the last on our board is what pets, pets, and the pets, pets. Animals are used for pets, and we have some in our homes. We have the dog, which is used for the security. We also have our cat. We have cat, which is also, we use it as what? Pets in our what? Homes. So what subjects are we talking about today? Know that today we are studying a new subject eh, called what? Our world, our people. Our world, our people, which we me call it Owen. And our topic is what? plants and what animals our topic is plants and animals and we have named some plants in the environment 
we have also see the uses of plants, food, medicine, furniture, clothes, lorry tires, and what basket. We also look at some animals in the community. We have the domestic animals, the reptiles, the insects, the mammals, the birds, the fishes. All right. Now we also talked about the uses of what animals. We have the food, getting food used for sports, used for transport, transportation. We also animals can use for what leather products like shoes, belts, and bags. And we also have what pets, pets, pets. And this is the end of our lesson in OS. So we meet again. Have a lovely day. Bye.